The true shape of the Earth. It is not a globe. NASA's entire space program has been built on a single lie. The Earth is a ball circling the Sun. That lie and everything built upon it must fall. WLC's purpose for existence has been the dissemination of truth to as many people as possible, to actively search out truth and share it as it is discovered. To do this effectively, WLC has remained independent of any denominational ties to freely prepare a people for the Savior's soon return. A new concept has arisen, the true form of the Earth. The WLC team has studied no other truth that at first glance, so obviously flew in the face of accepted scientific fact. The theory, the world is a globe revolving around the sun, has been accepted for so long it is now widely accepted as fact. Research has revealed the Earth is, in reality, not a globe spinning through endless realms of space. Neither spherical, as taught for 500 years, nor able to be fallen from the edges, the flat earth is exactly as the ancients have taught through scripture, a fixed mass of land and seas enclosed by a protective dome. Cultures the world over throughout history have all described and reported the existence of a geocentric, stationary, flat Earth. Egyptians, Indians, Mayans, Chinese, Native Americans, and literally every ancient civilization on Earth had a geocentric, flat Earth cosmology. Before Pythagoras, the idea of a spinning ball Earth was non-existent. And even after Pythagoras, it remained an obscure minority view until 2,000 years later, when Copernicus began reviving the heliocentric theory. Yahuwah is the creator. He works within his own laws of science. Just as scripture teaches, science, astronomy, and applied mathematics support a fixed earth enclosed by a dome. The word of the Almighty is sufficient evidence to support any belief or doctrine. Thus, even if the laws of science did not support this truth, WLC would embrace it. With this new understanding of the Earth's true layout, more light has been shed on prophecy. Scripture foretold, Thou must prophesy again, Revelation 10, 11. An enclosed Earth gives the complete and final fulfillment of the three angels' messages as the world is called upon to one. First angel's message, worship the Creator. Two, second angel's message. As this truth spreads, the various religious organizations that constitute Babylon will, without exception, reject this glorious truth. Thus, the second angel's warning of the fall of Babylon will reach its ultimate fulfillment. Three, third angel's message. All who stand for this truth will face persecution, as foretold by the third angel, when the Pope is made the leader of the new one world religion, teaching a globe earth encircling the sun. The WLC team invites you to study carefully the evidence for yourself. While you gather more information, it is fine to keep first things first in your life or to admit you are not sure about this. However, do not close your mind dogmatically to this possibility without reviewing carefully the evidence available. The danger in encountering new truth 
is the mind's dealing with a very different paradigm whereby, after assimilation, chaos arises with a grim determination never to be deceived again. The temptation is to throw out all of one's beliefs, even the truth one already has. Understand this reaction for the self-defense mechanism that it is, and do not rashly cast aside other established truths. Please do not reject this or any topic without careful and prayerful study. Be prepared to follow the truth wherever it leads. The angel told Daniel, at the time of the end, many shall run to and fro and knowledge shall be increased. Daniel 12.4 now is the time knowledge is being increased. As you study, remember the following three steps. 1. Stay open to new light. Reject nothing without careful and thorough research. 2. Accept nothing without careful and thorough research. Just because something is new does not automatically make it correct. 3. Share the truth you have been given with others. Study this subject carefully. Heaven has much more to reveal the diligent searcher for truth.